Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. Today in this video I'm going to show you how to make this adapter that will enable you to charge multiple 1S batteries using your own regular LiPo charger. So this is going to be a pretty cheap solution and it's also very easy to make it and it's going to be an alternative for getting this type of LiPo battery chargers. In order to make this adapter you're going to need a JSTXH male balance connector. I'm going to use a 4S one and therefore I'm going to use four PH2 female connectors. In addition, I've already pre-soldered 16 AWG wires to this XT60 male connector, and I also advise you to use a multimeter just to make sure that you wired everything properly. Now in case you're not aware of it, the four cells of the battery are connected in series. So when you're using a balance connector, the left pin of the balance connector is the battery plus, and the right one is the ground. So you can see when I'm testing these two pins, I'm getting 15.13 volts, which is the total voltage of the four cells. If I want to check each cell individually, I'm just going to check these two cells from the right. So this is the first cell, and you can see its voltage is 3.78 volts. Moving on to the second one, the ground is located over here where the plus was located before, and the plus just next to it. So you can see that the voltage of the second cell is 3.78 volt as well. Moving on to the third one, again, the ground is where the plus was before. So the voltage of the third cell is 3.78 volts as well. And finally, surprisingly, the voltage of the fourth cell is 3.78 volts as well. And that's because I've already balanced this battery. So basically what I'm going to do is just to cut the female part of the JST connector and then I'm going to solder the PH2 connector in the following manner. The ground is going to be soldered to the bottom wire, then the plus is going to be soldered to the second one, and so on. Then I'm going to solder the XC60 connector to the plus and ground wires, and then you'll be able to charge four single LiPo batteries simultaneously using your regular LiPo charger. Now the adapter is ready, so let's give it a try. You will have to plug all the batteries simultaneously. So I can just start the charging procedure normally, start the task, charge LHB batteries, and there you go, now the batteries are being charged. Just as a reminder, always be careful when charging your LiPo batteries and don't leave them unattended, and also recommend to use the same type of batteries when using this adapter. As always, I thank you for watching my video, I hope you enjoyed it and you find it useful. If you have any questions about making this adapter, feel free to ask it in the comment section down below. Don't forget to leave a thumbs up if you like this video and consider subscribing to my channel and hitting the notification bell if you're not already subscribed. See you in my next videos and goodbye.